It's now just over one month ago since the home explosion in Evansville claimed the lives of three people. Still, the investigation goes on. Today, investigators closed a portion of Weinbach Avenue as they tried to find a cause for that blast. Eyewitness News Cody Bailey has more on the Weinbach explosion. More than a month has passed since the deadly home explosion here on Weinbach Avenue, and as investigators continue searching for clues, residents continue searching for answers. It's, um, it's just an ongoing investigation. The slow, methodical investigation into the deadly Weinbach home explosion continues as investigators closed a portion of the road searching for clues. The closure, according to Evansville Fire Department Division Chief Mike Larson, was planned and not due to new evidence being discovered. Larson compares the investigation to putting pieces to a puzzle back together. While he understands residents want their questions answered, Larson explains why investigators are taking their time. We only get one chance. The investigators only get one chance to get this right and to, to hopefully bring this to conclusion, have some closure to this, and, and maybe potentially keep this type of a thing from happening again, not just in Evansville, but anywhere in the country. I think people definitely wonder about that and would like to see what they determine was the cause, if that's possible. Pastor Eric Rodden with Oak Hill Bible Fellowship also seeks closure as he continues making repairs to his church damage during the explosion. Just been working with companies trying to get those things repaired and uh, get our church back in order so we can keep doing our uh, regular activities, especially as we start up the, a new school year. Rodden was inside the church during the explosion and admits he flashes back to that day quite often, even during his daily commute. I drive by the scene every day, uh, you know, to get to work, so it's a constant reminder. It feels like it was a long time ago, but it feels like it was yesterday as well. Pastor Rodden hopes to have his repairs completed by early October. However, with the investigation, there currently is no timeline on if or when a cause could be determined. Reporting in Evansville, Cody Bailey, Eyewitness News.